All right, welcome back students. This is the grammar section for unit nine. Today we will talk about simple past and past progressive. Use the past progressive to describe an action that was in progress at a particular time in the past, but not completed. So not completed, that means it is continuing, it is progressing. Use the simple past to talk about a completed action in the past. So an example for that is I ate lunch. That's in the past. I ate, I finished, and I'm done with it. It's completed. I ate lunch. Now, a past progressive would be like, when I was eating lunch, I was eating lunch, I talked to Profe Ulysses. So, when I was eating, that's past progressive because it was continuing. So that's the grammar lesson for this section. And Google Classroom says exercise B, C, D, E. Read the other grammar section and F. Complete everything following the instructions. So let's go to B. B says read the sentence, underline the past progressive and circle the simple past. So we're going to work on identifying which is past progressive and which is simple past. So in the first one, I was studying for my exams when my mother called. All right, so we know past progressive is going to have was or were in a verb with ing. So was studying is past progressive and called is simple past. So this was continuing when this one happened. Number two, Jeanette was just washing the dishes when she heard the news. All right. Past progressive was just washing. And heard is your simple past. Number three, they were talking about you when you arrived. All right, so your past progressive were talking and arrived simple past. Number four. I was having a wonderful dream when the alarm went off. So I was having, was having, and then your simple past is went. The alarm went off is the same as the alarm sounded. The alarm turned on. We say went off, beep, beep, beep. All right, number five. I was working at a large corporation when the economic crisis took place. So was working is your past progressive and took is your simple past. This happened while this was happening. Number six. They were listening to the music when the phone rang. So they were listening is your past progressive when the phone rang. All right, so there you go. Now, exercise C, circle the correct words. So we need to make sure that we get our verb tenses Correct. So number one, we blank on the beach when the alarm blank. All right, so we were playing. This was happening when the alarm 
sounded. The alarm sounded and it stopped. It sounded. Number two, they blank to eliminate poverty when the policy blank. All right, so they were working to eliminate poverty when the policy changed. All right, number three, when he blank famous, he still spent a lot of time blank the poor. All right, so this one's a little tricky. So when he became, all right, you cannot use becoming because there is no is. If you're using a verb with ing, you need to be in front of it. So there is no is, so you cannot use becoming. So when he became, became is past. When he became famous, he still spent a lot of time helping or helped. All right, helping the poor. This is not past progressive. This is a gerund. Helping the poor. That is the object. That's why this one is tricky. Number four. I was blank along the beach when the earthquake blank. So I was, here's a form of to be. So you need jogging, I-N-G. I was jogging along the beach when the earthquake happened. And number five. She blank at night when she blank in an accident. All right, so she was doing something when this happened. So she was driving at night when she got in an accident. Number six, you blank when your father blank home. All right, so your father blank home. This one is came. So what was going on is you were not sleeping when your father came home. So there you go. That is exercise C using past progressive and simple past together. So in your book, I believe that you have this one here. This one is exercise D, so they're just switched. So right now, look at this. I think that this one is actually E in your book, but it's D in my book. So we need to write sentences using the past progressive and the simple past. So they give us the words we need to use and we need to make them fix make them we need to fix the sentences so my brother and i play in the yard break his arm so my brother and i this is we my brother and i were playing in the yard when he broke his arm my brother and I were playing in the yard when he broke his arm. Number two, Karen work on her project. Her favorite show comes on. All right, so Karen was working on her project when her favorite show came on. So came is the past for come. Number three, Dan, read a book, his mother calls. All right, so Dan was reading a book when his mother called, past tense, called. Number four, Dow was cleaning his room when his friends surprised him. Surprised with a D. Number five, Rose, sleep, her father comes home. 
Rose was sleeping when her father came home. Number six, my sister studying for exams. Her friends decide to have a party. So, my sister was studying for exams when her friends decided to have a party. So, add a D, decided. And there you go. So, let's go on to the next one. It says to complete the sentences that are true for you. So look, these first three give you the past progressive. So you need to add a part with the simple past. I'm not going to tell you what to write because they need to be true for you. So example, I was watching TV when I ate dinner. That's an example. When I ate dinner. So these, you have the past progressive. You need to add the part with the simple past. In 4, 5, 6, you have the simple past. You need to add the part with the past progressive. So that's how you complete this section. Now we're going to the last adverbs of manner. Adverbs of manner give more information about the way people do things. So examples, Lynn drove very carefully through the city. Could you please speak more clearly? So an adverb of manner answers the question, how? How was the verb done? How is the verb being done? Etc. So it's how. You have a verb, how. Now, to use this, we need to write sentences with adverbs of manner. So you need to think of a verb that you can do quickly for number one. What can you do quickly? Ah, okay. I can run quickly. So you need to give me a sentence using quickly. That's an example. I can run quickly. The second one says suddenly. Suddenly is when something is a surprise. It was not expected. So something happened suddenly. So that's how you want to use that one. Number three, think of something slowly. Like a turtle maybe. A turtle moves slowly. And then the last one, sadly. Sadly is doing something and looking sad or being sad. So write your sentences there. If you need more space, write them down here. That is everything for this video. Thank you for following along. I hope you have a great day.